behind me is a magnificent specimen of one of the world's ferns with the largest leaves. It's Angiopteris evecta, the mule's foot fern from tropical Asia. And uh, we've been growing this specimen since at least the 1960s. And uh, it's a member of what are called the eusporangiate ferns, which are ancient even among the ferns. And it does look like something very, very primeval. And uh, these giant leaves are mostly held up by water pressure. So they really need a wet tropical environment. And whenever there's not enough water, the leaves gradually um, deflate and will lower down. And then when they get water again, they raise up. So it shows just how much uh, can be supported from just water pressure. And uh, it's a, just an absolutely magnificent ancient fern. And it actually can be reproduced in a very unusual way, not just from the spores, but also from what are called oracles. The bases of each leaf has a little embryo of a, of a young fern that's a copy of the parent. And so they can be broken off and can make a whole new, new plant. And in fact, that's why this specimen has, has been reproducing that way for the last 50 years. So it keeps making new heads and uh, we've been able to share it with many other gardens.